So this last problem is a geometry problem that deals with the special right triangles, but it adds in a third one that most of you probably haven't studied. Um, and so that one is, well, because this is a 30 and this is a 45, and since this is a right angle, this has to be 15. And so this is a 75, 15, 90 degree triangle. And then you're given DE is 4. Now you may have dealt with this before and have some ways of getting around it, but the, the best way I've, I've heard to get around it is to recognize that the 75 can be split into a, um, a 60 degree angle and a 30 degree angle. And the reason that's good is because this becomes 15, which means this length is equal to that length. But we also created a 30, 60, 90 degree triangle, so that means this length is twice the short leg, so that's 8, so we know this length is 8. And then this length is just root 3 times the short leg, which is 4 root 3. The other thing you can remember, just memorize that the ratio of the um, um, short leg to long leg of a 55, 75, 90 degree right triangle is root 3 plus 1 to root 3 plus 2. And so you can see where I multiply 4 times root 3 plus 2 and I get 4 root 3 plus 8. Well now the rest of these are just easy special right triangles, so to go from here to here I divide by root 2. So 8 plus 4 root 3 all over root 2. So I multiply top and bottom by root 2. Um, these are going to cancel to 4 and 2. And so it gives me 4 root 2 plus 2 root 6. And then that, so that's what AC is because I divided by root 2 to get the leg of this 45, 45, 90. And then I'm, I, my ultimate goal is to find AB, but I've got to find this one first. BC, which is exactly half of this, and so it's going to give me 2 root 2 plus 2 root, or plus root 6. And then the last thing I do is when I go from the short leg to the long leg of a 30, 60, 90, I multiply by root 3. And so the correct answer becomes 2 root 6 plus root 18, though we don't want to leave it as root 18, and so it becomes 2 root 6 plus 3 root 2. And that is the correct answer for AB. Um, knowing something about 55, 75, 90 degree right triangles is very useful. If you know some trigonometry, you can learn a lot about them. And some of you might just already know what the ratio of the sides in a uh, 15, 75, 90 degree triangle, right triangle is. This just gives me the legs. If you add in your um, hypotenuse, it gets more complicated. We didn't need the hypotenuse, and so that's why we just stuck with looking at the ratio of the legs.